Tell me what I heard was wrong. I really wish I could. So, so my mother tried to go to bed with you. She was trying to break us up. She wanted it to look like I was trying to. Oh my God. Colby, I'm so sorry. You knew about this. I just found out about it in New York when everything got crazy. Where is my mother? Where is she? Is she here? No. Well, sweetheart, you're not here. Your mother and I are no longer together. I knew you were hiding something from me. You're right, I was. I thought maybe it was another girl, but my own mother. Colby, I mean, whatever they have said, I want a chance to explain. Explain? I just wanted you to open your eyes about Damon and see him for who he really is. Are you for real? All you have shown me is who you really are. Hey, stranger. Hi. How's uh, Ryan doing? Ugh, stubborn, wants to leave. Yeah, that sounds about right. I'm just waiting for an orderly to bring me some juice for him. Yeah, well, that might be a long wait, seeing how we've been significantly understaffed ever since Hayward took over. Yeah, I noticed. Yeah, how do you like this slogan? Medicine on the cheap. Uh, my boyfriend just had brain surgery here, so not so much. Well, you mean to tell me he didn't use a coupon? <laughs> <laughs> This feels good. Yeah, well, uh, <laughs> I think Randy's over-caffeinated cappuccino got me a little too punchy this morning. Oh, you missed my coffee. Yeah. So have you heard back from Ryan's doctor? No, he hasn't called and checked in yet, but uh, his last set of vitals were good. You know, Ryan will be fine if he just stays put for a few more days. Yeah, I considered using handcuffs and some rope. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> How are you doing? I'm good. Good. You know, you've been around here so much, somebody might actually put you to work. Where else would I be? I know. And I'm sure Ryan appreciates it, but uh, you're not the only one hanging around here. It really is a nice watch. I'm happy I found it for you. Meeting's running late. It's fine with me. I get to spend more time with my beautiful wife. Is that a new dress? Yeah. Nice, huh? Mm -hmm. New expensive shoes, too. Mm -hmm. Thank you. By the way, I used your credit card. You're welcome. Well, not that I mind, of course, but what happened to our financial arrangement, keeping our money separate? Oh, that, well, I changed my mind. I mean, what's mine is still mine, of course. And what's mine is... Is ours. As long as you expect me to play the part of the trophy wife, I expect you to pay for it. Hayward, please report to the fifth floor nurse station. David right Hayward back. to the fifth floor nurse station. All right, let's have it. Well, this certainly could have waited. Sorry, I thought it needed your immediate attention. Ryan's a very lucky man. Having someone like you around to take care of him? I like to think so. What do you want, David? I just saw Ryan's formal request for release. I'm hoping he'll change his mind. And I'm hoping you'll persuade him to. Because? For his health, of course. So if you need any help, for example, keeping unwanted visitors away from Ryan while he's trying to rest, give me a call. You could use a friend.